Para napapaisip ako, sabi ko, tuloy ba yung ordination? Mukhang tuloy naman. You know, this ordination, it's not really a magical event that will transform everything. But the ordination is a sign of affirmation because of what you have done, because of what you have become. And the whole community, the whole community of priests, the whole community even of the lay, lay cooperators, when the Father Provincial asked that you be ordained, his question or his answer stands on that witness. You continue to be formed after the heart, not just of Jesus, but also St. Augustine. That we are called to transformation 24-7. And maybe that is the witness that you are called to right now. To be a sign and symbol of transformation. A sign and symbol of conversion. Do you resolve to embrace the celibate state and to keep forever this commitment as a sign of your dedication to Christ the Lord for the sake of the kingdom of heaven in the service of God and man? I do. Do you resolve to maintain and deepen the spirit of prayer that is proper to your way of life and in keeping with this spirit and what is required of you to celebrate faithfully the liturgy of the hours with and for the people of God and indeed for the whole world? I do. People of God, our new deacon, Reverend Ramon Bitangkor III, OAR, from Tagbilaran City, Bohol. Tinanong ko rin po sa sarili ko kung kakayanin ko ba. Will I really be able to surpass the obstacles lodged on my path? But looking back at the providential moments of my life, of my entire journey in the seminary, I realized that I was never enough to begin with. Perhaps nobody is in fact. Yet, what sustained me was the sufficiency of God's grace. For it's in my weakness that God's strength emerges. Gihalat ko kini sa atong labaw na makagagahum. May God bless us all.